morning fam it is monday march the 4th happy monday mm, 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 mm. happy happy monday you guys i hope you all had a fantastic weekend i feel like i said that already but if i didn't i want to ask anyway or put that out there anyway so that i am not rude I had a very busy weekend this past weekend, and I'm not mad at it. I'm not mad at it at all. Of course, we had church on Saturday, and then Sunday, we assisted in helping our church move to our new location. Uh, everyone is so excited about the new location. It is so spacious. It's so nice. We have so many different areas that God has given us to just utilize. And I can't wait. It's obviously under construction still, you know, in cer certain areas of the property is still under construction, as you guys saw. But the potential is there. And I'm just so excited to see how everything comes together. Weekend. Oh, and shout out to the person that brought breakfast fish yesterday because when i tell y'all i almost hurt myself eating them kolaches husband just kept bringing the food bringing the food bringing the food i'm like sir <laughs> sir what did you do with all these carbs donuts kolaches and i mean the kolaches were large like they were this big i mean soft chewy buttery flaky the inside was filled with cheese the first one that i had the inside was filled with cheese and a beef sausage link then he came through with a donut i could i only took like two bites out of that i was like i'm done babe but then the spirit led him right on back to me baby with a philly cheese steak kolache what Baby, 10 out of 10 recommend. I was like, I was on a hunt trying to figure out where they got them from. I was like, where did y'all buy these? Like, I know this ain't Shipley's and Krispy Kreme. The few that we have left here in town, they don't sell kolaches. Like, they donuts only. So I was like, what well, did you get this from? A Shipley's? Because Shipley's, Shipley's Donuts, if you're unfamiliar with um, Texas, we have a lot of Shipley's Donuts here. And they do sell kolaches. I unfortunately can't partake because I don't eat pork. And they don't offer a majority of their locations don't offer a turkey option or just an egg and cheese option i did recently find one that offers an egg and cheese option and i might tap in one of these days you know within the next week or two just to see what it tastes like i'm sure it's freaking bomb because i actually love kolaches but y'all have never seen me eat them because again nine time out of nine the the options are only pork but anyway y'all because i see the people kind of moving around me uh coming in and out the gym the gym is very very packed we're off today of course if you're scratching your head like girl what are you doing you forgot i have my dentist appointment today right. on a journey to see if we can get some braces or invisalign but first we gotta have this first patient first patient appointment excuse me uh because i have to have my wisdom teeth taken out right that's not for the family members that been here that's for the family members that just got here and welcome thank you guys so much for joining us so we have that appointment today thus why i am out and about in these people's streets because i'm working go 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 and on the count of three go 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 and on the count of three go 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 Never let you in, cause you got me faced out. And don't take this person away. Hello, hello, it is 11.08. We are done with our second workout of the week. I feel very good and have a decent amount of time to spare. Um, until my dentist appointment at 12 30. I do have to arrive at uh, or 15 minutes early excuse me so I'll be sure to do that so that I can sign the paperwork and all of that but overall excuse me y'all overall I had a really good workout <sighs> excuse me I did three workouts in total 
upper, lower, and my total body workout for today was treadmill because when I walked in, I noticed all of the Stairmasters were gone. That area was totally empty. And um, I asked the lady that was working, which was very dry and rude, by the way. She, I don't know, either she just started or she never is there when I'm there. But I was like, excuse me, did something happen with the Stairmasters? Now, mind you, they do have a sign posted. But if I see a rep first before I take a look at the sign, you should still be obliged, okay, to uh, answer any questions that I have. So anyway, long story short, the truck that y'all see behind me is delivering and y'all might be able to see a little piece of it. Those are new Stairmasters. They have all of them installed for the most part, but I think what they're doing, cause it's, it's brand new equipment, right? Brand new Stairmaster, it looks slightly different. It looks like it has some additional bars on it. Like I'm really excited to get on it tomorrow morning, Lord willing. And I also appreciate the fact that they noticed that the Stairmaster is very popular. And when they got rid of the old one for an updated, that they considered adding additional Stairmasters. So baby, okay, they getting ready, all right? And I am not mad at it at all. I wanna know what kind of protein are y'all using? Because of course, y'all know, I recently purchased the Premier Protein and it's cool but it's a little too vanilla milkshake tasting for me, if that makes sense And the flavor. Yes, is vanilla milkshake, but my assumption, because I've never had protein before, so bear with you, girl, was that it, like, I wouldn't be able to taste it. Once I put in the oatmeal, once I put in the fruit, I wouldn't be able to taste it and and i also use milk as well and i don't think i'm gonna do that moving forward because i i know for a fact that added to the milky flavor it wasn't disgusting it was good and flavorful but i wasn't I, i'm trying to go for like a smoothie cake flavor okay so i need to tap in and get me some tart cherries i need some kiwi i need some watermelon like i really need to tap in because it was giving milkshake it was, it was kind of giving milkshake. And I don't know if that's the protein, so I need y'all to comment down below and let me know. Educate your girl, please. Because baby, I, I didn't do bad for my first go round and I'm going to make it again tomorrow. Luckily, I didn't buy large bags of fruit. So after about another use or two, I'm gonna be completely done with the bags. And when I grocery shop again, I you know can use that opportunity to buy other fruit even though i'm cooking the turkey wings won't be done for about another five hours or so and that's quite some time and i know i'll be hungry before five hours i mean the smoothie is doing it but i don't think it's gonna do it for for a whole another five hours or so to radios and I decided to give them a chance and I'm glad that I did I enjoyed my experience unfortunately because of the way that my teeth are impacted wisdom teeth is specifically what I'm talking about because of the way my wisdom teeth are impacted they can't extract extract in the office unfortunately so they had to refer me out to their ortho so whole time let me bag it up, bag it up, bag it up. I thought I scheduled with the ortho. That was on me. That's not on them because, girl, how you gonna skip to the specialist and not even be seen as a new patient? Make it make sense. And my excitement 
and thirst to just get these darn wisdom teeth out and to also um chill i'm looking i'm i'm kind of i'm not new new to this area but i'm kind of new to this area so so i'm trying to see what they what all they have because i'm low-key kind of hungry but anyway i digress um yeah that was that was my fault okay i was just way too thirsty doing too much and sis was skipping steps in her head so today i had an appointment at one of many mint dentistry's offices seen as a new patient um unbeknownst to me okay i was provided with a free tooth whitening kit because of the type of dental insurance that i have it it has very detailed directions i showed y'all a snippet of the video child they show you a step-by-step -step video of how to do it they also took um impression of my teeth top and bottom and the impressions are here this will kind of give me like a little feel for what's to come lord willing when i um decide to do invisalign or if i decide to do invisalign over braces kind of sort of right not exactly but kind of sort of and here is the whitening solution so really excited to have that and then they also gave me this really cute plastic it's not i mean yeah it's plastic like little case and in this case they gave your girl some chapstick a toothbrush and some colgate toothpaste and this white slip here is the referral slip for the orthodontist office okay we have made it to the step that we thought we was gonna be at today okay the lord had to slow me down and pump my brakes this is, this is ski taste all right so that's the referral to the orthodontist i went ahead and scheduled for the 25th which is a monday at noon so we're gonna work from home that monday as well and i've already told my job last week that i'm gonna have reoccurring appointments until we get these teeth out okay and until i have uh my invisalign or my braces taken out sis will have reoccurring appointments right because you gotta go back periodically to let the dentist do whatever the dentist do okay whatever they went to school to do you you got to go see them periodically i know for a fact my mother had braces and she would have to go you know often i guess to get them retightened or if you have any issues and so on and so forth not sure how it works with invisalign if they just give you the trays and then you pop in to sh you know to to check in to see what the progress is and to get your other set of trades i don't know i don't know this is all new to me new to us we are experiencing and on this journey together child okay so i'm really excited um i could have scheduled as soon as this wednesday and to be honest with you i should have but i wanted to space it out and not do everything all at once even though you know what now that i'm thinking about it because i did ask them what how how this appointment would be like would it be a um would it be a regular degular schmegler appointment or is they going to try to take my teeth the same day she was like oh no it's going to be a new patient so you know what i'm gonna go ahead and move my new patient up i think i'm gonna call them when i put y'all down and let them know because this particular office only sees patients on Mondays and Wednesdays. And I'm either going to schedule it for this Wednesday or next Wednesday. Ain't no sense in waiting for a new patient appointment, child, because they just want to see me and charge my insurance. That's it. They're not going to do nothing to me. They're just going to see me, take some money from my insurance company, which is fine because it's not coming out my pocket. And they're going to give me a plan of action. Already, 
It is now 3.36, so I have been home for quite some time. I did have some work that I needed to complete when I came back home from my dentist appointment, so that is what I did. I've also checked my turkey wings. I done did it again. Them turkey wings, baby, them turkey wings. They're so delicious, so good, so flavorful. I cannot wait to eat tonight. Like, I'm so excited to eat tonight. Um, I do still have them in the oven. They're fork tender at this point. I'm just trying to make sure, make sure, make sure that it's cooked and it is very, very tender. So I plan on leaving it in the uh, oven for about another hour or so. So maybe take it out around 4.30 and let it rest before I serve dinner. In the meantime, I am going to make my sides because those are not made yet. Again, if you forgot, we're having mashed potatoes and gravy and we're also having uh, mac and cheese as well. And I think I might also do corn on the cob, but stay tuned for that because y'all know I love putting extra stuff on my plate, child, because the meal will still be complete with the mac and cheese and the mashed potatoes and gravy but sis gotta always do too much but anyway while i have found a stopping point at work i wanted to show you guys the things that i got from five below of course no trip to five below is complete without going to the dog section for a benji so i picked up this three-piece set throw and play toys for dogs these do squeak yeah they do squeak and it says that it's vanilla scented Oh, you can kind of smell it. I guess because I was near like the incense and all of that, I really couldn't smell it. I was like, child, let me just get it because it's a ball, not because it smelled, but you actually can smell the vanilla. Benji really likes his ball. He took it outside, child, and I told Benjamin, okay, that if he took that, that ball outside, that was going to be his outside ball. And these balls will be his inside balls. I just didn't want to, want to have them all over the crib. So that's why I only gave him one chair. You know, you got to treat him like churn sometimes. And then what else did I get? I also settled on this uh, AirPods Gen 3 protective case. I wish they had a black one or other options. Not black because I just had a black one and I do want something different. They didn't have much of a selection. It is what it is. I don't even know how much I paid for this. AirPod case. Okay, $4. Four dollars. Why did I buy that um AirPod case that didn't fit my AirPods for almost $10? Okay, we're going to be getting our AirPod case covers, protective cases, whatever the hell you want to call them, skins from five below. Y'all tap me on my show the next time I talk about getting one of these because yeah, we tapping into five below. Anyway, I decided to get this pretty blue color. It's like a blue periwinkle kind of giving hints of purple-ish kind of color. The other options were, I believe, pink and yellow. And neither one of those are my color. I mean, no shade. Sorry about my nose ring. And then on the other side of the um, display, they had character ones. And y'all know, I'm at my big age. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm, I just wasn't finna do it. Okay. Especially you're not finna catch me uh, having this clamped on to my backpack talking about some Barbie or whatever have you yeah i'm not gonna do it so i decided to <laughs> be basic and if you do you know we friends and we most definitely family that's just not your good sis jam okay definitely got to keep it basic and i try to keep it grown so i picked these up i also got some more incense i'll be burning one of them soon and lastly, y'all know I got to peruse that the t-shirt section or whatever because I absolutely love Five Below's t-shirt. This one says, follow your dreams, go back to sleep. Oh, try it again. Go back and wake up and try it again. I thought that this was really cute. I got it in a size large and I actually have uh, some shoes, some Nikes. I think they're 270s with a color similar to this. It's not like totally matchy matchy, but I told y'all I don't really care what I look like when I go to the gym. That's just me. So I'm going to pair those shoes with this shirt. I'll probably pair it tomorrow for tomorrow's workout, Lord willing, but I thought this was really cute. I figured out that in five below shirts, these graphic tees, I'm a large. Now mind you, I could fit a small, definitely could fit a medium. 
but these are gym shirts and around the house shirts. And I like these to be oversized in the event you're new here, not talking to the family members that have already been here. So that's why I prefer to get these shirts in a large. My grand total at five below was $28.11. So I didn't do too, too bad at five below for my impromptu shopping trip. For now, I'm going to put these things away, light and incense. It's 3.50, so my work day is winding down. I do have some laundry that I have to fold. Again, I have to finish the sides for my dinner. So I wanna do all of those things, if possible, as early as possible, so that I can get a video completely edited, scheduled, queue up another video and go to sleep early. That's the goal because tomorrow, the plan is for us to go to, to the gym. Now, if I don't go to the gym for whatever reason, I'm gonna give myself grace and I probably should not go to the gym because I went Sunday, went today. My body probably does need a break on Tuesday and then pick it up Wednesday. But I feel like if I got momentum and the spirit moves me to go, we gonna go tomorrow. But if not, I'm gonna give myself grace because I'm still on track to do my three days in the gym this week and we'll pick it up another day before Friday. But so far, my mindset is still ongoing tomorrow. So just stay tuned for that because that will be in this vlog. I hope you guys have been having a fantastic day thus far. And if you're not, it's okay, it's okay. The day is not over, so you still have time to turn it around. Don't <laughs> let whatever it is ruin your day, okay? You make sure you turn it around. It is in your power to do so, and you have a good rest of your day. I'm gonna get to moving around this house. Y'all know, doing what I do or whatever, and I'll pick you guys up in a bit. I get him out of your mind. He said he rap. He ain't signed. That ain't a good sign. Change your mind. The conversation is some rosy wine. Unless there's some other things you got in mind. In my way. So much for rocking with me in this vlog if you enjoyed it please be sure to give this video a huge thumbs up if this is your first time here don't leave a stranger hit that subscribe button to join the fam and hit that post notification bell so that you will never miss another one of my uploads and i will see you guys in the next vlog bye